hey guys long time no instagram video in today's video i am going to be sharing with you 10 instagram story acts that you can start using today some of you might know some some of you might not know some of them but you know me now instagram story queen and i'm going to be sharing some of my favorite acts that i feel like it's easy it's something that you should always do every single time when you're on instagram and it's something that you should take note of and be very intentional about especially if you're somebody that wants to stay on brand and you're somebody that likes um aesthetically pleasing instagram stories or you want to use some of the instagram features one thing instagram always wants us to do is use as many features as possible so i'm going to be sharing some of my favorite features with you you might know some you might not know some some of you might be oblivious to the fact but you know me now your social media bestie my name is balaji i am a social media manager mentor and a full-time content creator and this is my youtube channel please don't forget to like this video don't forget to turn on the notification bell don't forget to subscribe and let's go right into what i have for you today the first act i'm going to do is sharing changing the background color when you share a post to your story so i just shared mills post one thing you want to do is come to this three dots here and you click on the draw tool and there are so many colors for you to choose from you can just swipe so if you like have like a brand color let's say your brand color is yellow just click on yellow and long press on the screen and there you go so you can actually that's how you change the color of any singular post that you want to now for example maybe you want to pick like a color from the picture like maybe you don't have that specific color you can click on this color picker tool and swipe it to maybe let me swipe it to muse profile picture and i'm going to double click on it and there you go that's how you can change the background color of a post that you share to your stories. I'm going to show you exactly how you can assess more colors apart from the ones that I've shown you. So this is Dimitri's post and I'm going to click on that three dot again and click on draw. Now something about how to access more colors, you can just long press on a color and it's going to open the entire color wheel. So you can assess different shades of yellow, different shades of pink. You can just move your hand around and that's how you access as many colors as you want. This is what people also use to do that rainbow text effects that they normally always do on stories if they want to. Now I'm going to show you exactly how you can add music to your background. For starters, if you want access to the entire music library and you also still want to keep your business creator profile, you want to change your digital category to entrepreneur. And the best way to do that is come to your profile, click on edit profile, and you're going to see this part called category and click on it. And what you want to go and look for is entrepreneur and you want to change it and select entrepreneur i don't want that so i'm just going to cancel click on music and then you can add any song so i'm going to add unstoppable you can add the text if you want to you can change the colors if you want to you can do you can change the way you want it to appear and you can just reduce or minimize it and put it anywhere on your stories and ha that's how you add music to your stories now the next one is how to search for any kind of filter on instagram like a lot of people don't know that you can search for any kind of filter on instagram and even on tiktok but i'm not talking about that so what you want one thing you want to do is you want to go to scroll down on your filter until you see the search browse effect and click on it and then you can just click on search and if you know the name of the filter you can check for it you can see the trending filters that are currently trending on instagram now appearance aesthetic like they are all grouped for you to like select the ones that you want most of them are not loading probably because of my network but you can see them with time they get to load and everything and that's how you actually um how would i say it you can see that my filters some of the filters you can go for aesthetic if you're someone that is more of the aesthetically pleasing kind of filter and everything but this is how you search for any kind of filter on instagram how exactly do you create multiple stories at once so i'm going to show you so for example you can just click on different things i'm going to click on if you want to create multiple stories at once you don't want to be selecting posting one at a time you can just click on this select button and then you select you can only select 10 at once so once it reaches 10 that's the maximum you can click on more and you click on this and you can customize your story 
one after the other as you see me do here even if it's a video you can customize your story you can make them longer you can post your 60 seconds long video you can add your text customize them one after the other but that's how you post multiple stories at once on instagram Another feature I really love when it comes to Instagram is the grid feature. I use it to showcase my pictures if I don't want to post them one after the other. All I have to do is click on the layout and you can also change the grid if you want it to be three, if you want it to be six, if you want it to be two, if you want it to be dependent. And you can take pictures if you want like this or you can just add a picture from your gallery. So let me just add this. You can see this here and I can add this too if I want to. You can also minimize and add your text if you want to. But that is how you had grid to grid pictures without actually using things like maybe in short or photo grid, just doing it directly in Instagram stories. Now, let me show you guys how to use the green screen. So, for example, you want to teach something as a creator or a business owner. You want to showcase something. All you have to do is scroll down to the effect, click on it, and you want to click on search and type in Instagram green screen. It's going to give you different options, but the very first one is the Instagram green screen. One thing you're going to see about this feature is it's going to take time to load depending and you can see like there's a background behind me and you can click on add media so for example let's say i want to explain something about let me check if i have let me let me explain something about these different people i took pictures with and you can also minimize yourself using both fingers you can minimize yourself like this and put yourself somewhere you can put yourself up so that you can be pointing and say oh this is me this is somebody else you can also move it while you're recording and that is how you use the green screen feature on instagram let me show you exactly how to add a translucent translucent layer on your pictures now a lot of people don't know what a translucent layer is so for example you want to show something off but you don't want to show it off completely so let me like go to um my favorite let me just pick a picture let's say this picture of me speaking i want to show it off but i don't want to show it off completely adding a translucent layer just come to these three dots here and click on draw then you see this third um the third um, marker that's what you do now let's say i want to pick like a color from the picture i'm going to use this pink here long press on it and it's going to add like a translucent layer your background will still be showing it won't fill the background it's the first one that fills the background but the middle one creates like a translucent layer that people can still see what is behind it and you can just maybe play with the eraser to and maybe just round this thing um erase some parts of it then write whatever you want to write or maybe use the arrows or the draw tool or every single thing but yeah this is how you create translucent layers that you can make that can that you can use to write like any text or prep your audience about what it is that you want to post another feature that you want to like take advantage of is live photos turning live photos to boomerang so you don't have to like create boomerangs directly from instagram if you use an iphone i think you're the only one that has this feature i'm not sure androids have this feature so directly from taking live photos in your camera you can just upload them so for example, this is an example of a live photo I did. And you can see here, it says create a boomerang from your live photo. So I can just click on it and you can see it's cre creating the boomerang for me. I can also like choose the options there. So I don't have to like just create a, um, like a fresh boomerang. I can just use my live photos because I use an iPhone, upload it to Instagram stories, create a boomerang and write whatever text I want to write lastly i'm going to show you exactly how you can assess more gifts on your instagram stories you want to come to the create feature and this is the create feature it has different other features there's the shout out and there is the gift so you can search for any gift will give you so i can say wake up and i can click on done and it's going to search for any gif on wake up and i can just click on it and there you go you see that oh no let me go back to it wake up and when you click on wake up click on it's saying <laughs> hello okay let me do hello so you can see that this is hello and i'm going to like maybe you can switch and you can just pick up any gift that you want 
and click on next and there you go you have a different gif and you can just whatever thing is in your mind from hello to goodbye to good night to what's up to how are you i'm just saying like the regular greetings you can just access them from the gift library through the create mode on your stories and there you go guys 10 instagram story acts i think you should start using today on instagram to keep your instagram stories very interactive and something that your followers are always looking forward to watch i hope you found this video helpful if you did please don't forget to like don't forget to share don't forget to follow and i'll see you guys in my next video